Daja hao, washers on England the Jack. Hello everyone, my name is Jack and welcome to another podcast. Today I'm joined by Kara. Daja hao. Daja hao, wash kala. That was very good. That's just like me. <laughs> so, Kara, are you a fan of Jessie J at all? Uh, I'm not like crazy about her mm. but um I like her you know okay. because she's such a wonderful and talented singer oh most definitely well I'd never really listened to her much before now to be honest um she is very popular in the UK in the US but I never really paid her much attention but I've watched some videos of her recent singing and I'm just amazed it's really really good unreal mm it's almost like two singers at once. It's incredible. Oh, yeah, it really is. I mean, she has such an incredible range. Definitely. It's a real gift, I think. Mm. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安,我呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道,每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语,听说读写的内容,我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话,记得给我们订
What? Why? Why? Because the pronunciation sound the same. Oh, okay. Well, Jesse, I, Jesse. Jesse. Oh, I should have known that one. <laughs> that was obvious. So, actually, this Jesse 姐呢，早早在这个 Double Eleven 就是双十一晚会上面就有精彩的表演。然后呢，这一次又来到了湖南卫视参加了歌手的节目。So Jesse J is going to be on the TV show now. I don't know what the TV show is called. Actually, do you know the name? Singer, singers. Singer. Oh, wow. singers. Okay, right. Well, I actually saw a recent video of her performing in China.、Uh, however, I noticed that the lyrics at the bottom of the screen were translated differently. Yeah, I know this really surprised you. <laughs>、yeah. But the lyrics is somewhat related to sex,、oh. and in case it can have a negative influence to children and teenagers who might watch the show. So, you、oh, know. <laughs> I suppose so. I suppose. I, I. I mean, I noticed the first one she changed was, I'm feel well, not she changed, but was changed、yeah. for her was. I'm feeling sexy and free was changed to I'm feeling fancy and free, but I don't understand what's wrong with a girl feeling sexy. <laughs>、uh, I think sexy is okay. Yeah, it's okay. Nothing wrong with it. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. But the next lyrical change I noticed was、um, "dirty dancing" became "dizzy dancing," and <laughs> I really don't understand what's wrong with "dirty dancing." There's no bad words. <laughs> so- Actually, dirty dancing refers to what? Well, I, I suppose it refers to dancing very close to somebody.、Uh-huh. So, you know, I suppose you could sort of think it was maybe sexual, I guess. But I don't know. I don't know if it's if anybody would really understand that it means that though. Who was who were reading it? Is it the same as strip tease? No, no, not at all. Not the same. Not at all. No, no, no. Miles away.、Uh, okay, 但是可能是因为因为它是一个 TV show, so、um, it's a lot more strict. Yeah. Be- because if yeah. you check the music gaps, it's the same the ori- original lyrics. Oh、yeah. right. Okay. Okay. 好，那我们再聊到另外一个话题啊。On another topic, Zhang Tian, 这个被誉为我们这一届的一个黑马。I know you saw the video of Queen B's performances, performance of Lady Marmalade yesterday. What did you think about her English singing? Well, I was actually blown away by it. I mean, she sang like a native speaker. I, I mean, I was I was asked if I could hear anything wrong with you know the words she used or her pronunciation, but I couldn't hear a single fault. I was blown away. Uh, blown away. So he touched the shoe. Oh yeah. Um, blown away is an expression of disbelief at how good something was.、Uh, so, for example, you could say, "I was blown away by the film last night." You're just you're amazed by it. Ah,、uh, so he is not just like knock somebody off their feet. Hmm. Yeah, it's very、uh, similar to that. So, yeah. so it is to let someone open the eyes, open the eyes. So, what did you think of her English? So actually, <laughs> the truth is, she's not a Chinese. Oh. Yeah, her father is from Singapore and her mother is from England. Oh. So that's、okay. why her English is perfect, cause she is a native. Okay, right. I didn't realize she was half English. <laughs> right. Wow, that that makes sense.、Mm. But、uh, well, she actually sang some French in that song as well, and it was really good. What was it? Um, she sang "Voulez-vous coucher avec moi." So that means, do you want to sleep with me tonight? <laughs> <laughs> so she's allowed to sing that, but Jesse J can sing "Sexy and Free." Yeah, exactly. You're allowed to say, "Do you want to sleep with me tonight?" But not, "I'm feeling sexy and free." <laughs>、uh, <laughs> 好吧，好吧，可能是因为这个法语的全民普及度还是没有英语那么的高啊。I guess it's because not many Chinese people know French. Exactly. <laughs> so、yeah. there's no need to avoid that. Well, the、uh, the French phrase was actually made popular in the English-speaking world in 1975, when the original song first came out. So it's one of those phrases that lots of English speakers know because it's something we all like to say to each other as like a bit of a joke, you know. Voulez-vous coucher avec moi? 天哪，原来这句话的意思是你今晚想和我睡吗？我简直是毁三观，以后都不好意思唱这个了。Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语，
听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。Okay, well,、uh, that's all we've got for you today's、uh, podcast. But I recommend you check out、uh, Jesse,、uh, Jesse J, Jesse, Jesse J, Jesse J. There we go. Jesse J. Jesse J. Okay, okay, don't do that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 好了，那我们今天节目就到这儿了。我是卡拉，我是 Jack。我们下次再见吧，拜拜。再见，拜拜。